perpendicularity. Like parallelism, perpendicularity is the tolerance that controls that an element in a part is 90 degrees inclined to another element. Difference between parallelism and perpendicularity is the value of the angle. The value for parallelism was zero degrees, and here it's 90 degrees. Everything else is the same between the two tolerances, which means for the perpendicularity, I need to first define my datum. So, I have this part that looks like that, and then I point to this surface and I say this is surface A, and I want that surface to be perpendicular to A. So I put the symbol of perpendicularity which looks like that, and I'd say here is my reference and the value is 0 0.1, which means I have two parallel planes. These two parallel planes are perpendicular to surface A, and the distance between them is 0 0.1. And any point on the tolerated surface should lie between these two parallel planes. I can also tolerate a line to the surface A. So, if I have a hole here in the part, if I point at the center line by pointing at the dimension line, and I say, I want the center line to be perpendicular with A with a value of 0 0.1. I mean, I want the center line of this hole to be between two parallel planes. So only in the direction of the drawing, it's perpendicular to A. I leave it like that. If I want to say it has to be a cylinder, so I want to tolerate it in all directions, then I should add my diameter sign. What this means, is there should be a cylinder here with a diameter of 0 0.1, and the cylinder, it is perpendicular to surface A, and any point on the axis or center line of the hole should lie inside the cylinder. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a like and drop a comment below. We'd love to hear your thoughts or questions. And if you're into leveling up your skills with expert-led content, hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications. For full courses, downloadable assignments, and certifications, head over to excitify.com. Start learning smarter today.